वेलकम बैक टू एक्टिव टू टू पॉइंट ट्वेल्व वी नीड टू चेक पी एच ऑफ सॉइल वी सिंपली नीड अ पी एच पेपर विल चेक पी एच ऑफ सॉइल एंड वील सी देर इज नो चेंज इन कलर एंड समथिंग इन मिसिंग वी नो दैट सब्सटेंसेज कैन एक्ट एज एन एसिड और बेस ओनली इन प्रेजेंस ऑफ वाटर सो वी विल परफॉर्म द टेस्ट अकॉर्डिंग टू द प्रोसीजर गिवन वी विल एड दिस सॉइल इन वाटर द कॉम्पोनेंट्स which can be soluble in water from soil will get dissolved in it most of the part remain insoluble and that makes it some reddish brown in color now again we cannot take up this paper directly and check the ph because there is some colored components over here what we do rather we take up a filter paper with funnel this is used to filter the things we will filter out this solution the filtrate what we collect in this conical flask now that's going to be the clear solution you can clearly see this so this filtrate what we have that's the water which contained some dissolved components which were there in soil that makes that substance acidic or basic whatever it is so we have to collect that little more but right. now we can check ph of this solution you can see this color the original color of ph paper if i dip it in the solution see that this little change in the color observed with the litmus uh, with this ph paper If you compare this color with the pH scale, the color is ranging from slight yellowish to very, very, very light green. So that on pH scale, that color ranges from pH five, six to seven. Somewhat we can consider six to seven range. It depends on the nature of soil what we have obtained. So the soil what we have collected, its pH is ranging from six to seven. This is considerably a good pH for most of the plant. so this is how we can check ph of the soil depend on what kind of soil you take you get different range of ph and that's about activity 2.12